Okay, so um, today I am doing stand um, cover, you know, and then okay. Uh, <clears throat> My tears gone cold, I'm wondering why. Got a house beard at all. Morning wake up, drop my windows, and I can't see it all. Even if I could, it would all be great. But your picture on my wall, it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. It keeps on cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed and all. Morning rain comes up my window, and I can't see it all. Even if I could, it would all be great. But your picture on my wall. It reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dear Slim, I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. I left myself, my picture, and my home phone at the bottom. I sent two letters back in autumn. You must not have got them. It probably was a problem at the post office or something. Sometimes I scribble addresses too sloppy when I jot them. But anyways, fuck it. What's been up then? How's your daughter? My girlfriend's pregnant too. I'm about to be a father. If I have a daughter, guess what I'm a call her? I'm a name of Bonnie. I read about your uncle Ronnie too, I'm sorry. I had a friend kill himself over some bitch you didn't want him. I know you probably hear this every day, but I'm your biggest fan. I even got the underground shit that you did with Scam. I got a room full of your posters and your pictures, man. I like the shit you did with Ruckus too, that shit was bad. Anyways, I hope you get this man. Hit me back, Mr. Chat. Truly old, your biggest fan, and this is Van. Ugh, oh, I don't like doing this bit. So we'll just skip it. Yeah. But your picture on my wall It reminds me that it's not so bad It's not so bad Dude, I still don't call it a rope I hope you have a chance I ain't mad I just think it's fucked up you and fans If you didn't want to talk to me outside the concert You didn't have to But you could have signed an autograph from Matthew That's my little brother man. He's only six years old He ran in a blistering cold for you Four hours and you just said no that's pretty shitty, man. You're like his fucking idol. He wants to be just like you, man. He likes you more than I do. I ain't that mad, though. I just don't like being lied to. Remember when we met in Denver? You said if I write you, you write back. See, I'm just like you in a way. I never knew my father, neither. He used to always cheat on my mama and beat her. I can relate to what you're saying in your song. So when I have a shitty day, I drift away and put him on. Because I don't really got shit out. So that shit helps when I'm depressed. I even got a tattoo with your name across the chest. Sometimes I even caught myself to see how much it bleeds. It's like adrenaline. The pain is such a sudden rush from me. See, everything you say is real. And I respect you because you tell it. My girlfriend's jealous because I talk about you 24-7. But she don't know you like I know you, Slim. No one does. She don't know what it's like for people like us growing up. You gotta call me, man. I'll be the biggest fan you'll ever lose. Sincerely yours, Stan. P.S. We should be together, too. <sighs> I'm gonna break. He needs to turn that down. Even if I could, it would all be great. But your picture on my wall, it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dear Mr. I'm too good to call or write my fans. This will be the last package I ever send your ass. It's been six months and still no work. I don't deserve it. I know you got my last two letters. I wrote the addresses on them perfect. So this is my cassette I'm sending you. I hope you hear it. I'm in the car right now. I'm doing 90 on the freeway. Hey Slim, I dreamt of this vodka. Is that me to drive? You know this song by Bill Collins in the air of the night about the guy who could have saved that other guy from drowning. But then, and Bill saw it all in that show, he found him. That's kind of how this is. You could have rescued me from drowning. Now it's too late. I'm on a thousand down this now. I'm drowsy. And all I wanted was a lousy letter or a call. I hope you don't rip all of your pictures off the wall. I love you, man. We could have been together. Think about it. You ruined it now. I hope you can't sleep and you dream about it. And when you dream, I hope you can't sleep and you scream about it. I hope you conscious ages you and you can't breathe without me. See Slim, shut up bitch, I'm trying to talk. Hey Slim, that's my girlfriend screaming in the trunk, but I didn't slit her throat. I just tied her up. See, I ain't like you, cause if she suffocates, you suffer more, and she'll die too. Well, I gotta go, I'm almost at the bridge now. Oh shit, I forgot, how am I supposed to send this shit out? Oh. I'll spit.
world I can see it all Even if I could, it would all be great But your picture on my wall It reminds me that it's not so bad It's not so bad You understand? I meant to write you sooner, but I'd just be busy You said your girlfriend's pregnant now How far along is she? Look I really glad that you would call your daughter that, and here's an autograph for your brother. I wrote it on the starter cap. I'm sorry I didn't see you at the show, I must have missed you. Don't think I did that shit intentionally, just to diss you. But what's this shit you said about you, like, just a little, what's this shit, this clowny dog, come and how fucked up is you? You got some issues, Dan, I think you need some counseling to help your ass and bounce it off the walls and you get down some. And what's this shit about us meant to be together? That type of shit would make me want us to meet each other. I really think you and your girlfriend need each other, or maybe you just need to treat her better. I hope you get to read this letter, I'm just overreaching you in time before you hurt yourself. I think that you'll be doing just fine if you relax a little. I'm glad I inspire you, but stand, why you so mad? Try to understand that I do want you as a fan. I just don't want you to do some crazy shit. I seen this one shit on the news a couple weeks ago that made me sick. Some dude was drunk and drove his car over a bridge and had his girlfriend in the trunk and she was pregnant with his kids and in the car he found a tape but didn't say who it was too. Come to think about it, his name was, it was you. Damn. Ugh, thank you for watching, goodbye.